Oh, what's in the box? Yes, sir. We're officially back at it. This is Book Nice coming at you with a uh, prop review. Let's do it. This ain't for no scalper. You a scalper? Then fuck out shit. This one for them real collectors. That's army building and posing figures. Marvel legends. Imports. Many make the I'm fucking with. High beast we know about. You. Stay buying figs don't know about. It. All right, so taking a brief little intermission from reviewing, I actually have the uh, Phantom X, Psylocke, and Nimrod 3-pack on the table right now as well. So I'll be uh, getting around to shooting all of the segments for that shortly. But I want to send a shout out to my man, Terraformer, who I think has one of the best <laughs> um, handles in the game, one of the best names in the game, Terraformer. I think that is very cool. But, um, you know, I'm on my, my world tour to try to get props, accessories, dioramas from some of the best people in the game or from some of the people that I admire. You know, I want to get one thing from everybody that I really admire and whose work I really like. Some of those folks are going to be really hard to get work from because uh, it's super expensive to ship dioramas internationally. So some of the people that are across the pond or what have you, I may have a hard time figuring that out. But yeah, I got a little six part crate set from my man Terraforma here. So it's all foam obviously he does do some stuff that's a, a more hardened like more realistic material honestly I'm not really a fan of that really heavy stuff if you can do it and do it super lightweight and make it look realistic like he's done here then I'm, then I'm all for that so these all look good they are not none of them are finished through the back though so I guess he made them like that so you could kind of put them up against the wall if you need to without damaging the, the paint or what have you you know simple things like this can be utilized in a, in a big way you know you don't need a lot of space or uh, any intricate or extravagant dioramas to to do simple things with something like this or to do simple things in general uh, you know you don't need the most expensive lighting you don't need the most expensive camera you just need drive you just need determination and you just need the will to to get it done motivation and creativity and that's it but you know something like this I could think of a thousand little different ideas that I want to do with just these these crates you know um, one of the two of them were kind of like stuck together with the paint a little bit out of the package so so I did get a little paint scuff there but you know I could probably just take to that with some of my own little cheap paint around here uh, it's not like they all need to look pristine you know these are boxes they may be sitting on a dock somewhere or, or what have you but I definitely like the look of these I guess I'll get these into something now and there we go quick and easy broke out some of my hasbro gi joe figures destro which i took a look at in a sort of laid back casual like play day video baroness i actually just opened for the first time for this shot so this is the baroness that came with the bike i'm not really a fan of the bike i see a lot of people utilizing the bike uh from the marvel legends black widow to pair a baroness i'll try that we'll see what happens but I do like the head sculpt for her. I do like the way she pairs here with uh, Destro. And I set up something quick and easy. You can do this too. Everything that's on my channel is designed to uh, entice you to do display work. Even when I do reviews, they're all uh, kind of framed in a way to get you to be a display artist. And that's what I've been doing for my whole career on this channel. So if you're new to the channel, everything is about ACBA. It's about toy photography. It's about displaying. So, you know, I utilize the boxes here as somewhat of a backdrop. I've got Destro and Baroness. Looks like they're toasting to maybe one of Destro's arms deals. We got a bag of money. That bag of money came with a uh, Breaking Bad Walter White figure, I believe. And these little um, glasses with the brandy in it and the uh, carafe there uh, were from Extreme Sets. But I think they got them through like a third party, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, there is just a gradient poster paper backdrop back there. A couple of lights in that backdrop. I used the gates that came with the uh, Marvel Select Shitari figures, if I'm not mistaken. So I used two of those. Made it kind of look like we had a dock. The base is just the uh, base to my diorama my tenement diorama from my man Chris Lyons and then yeah like I said I've got them kind of flanked by uh, Terraformers boxes here and yeah something simple clean cropped and contained that's what ACB is about I'll shoot this and I'll use this for uh, for simple Sunday but 
yeah, big shout out to my man Terraformer. Uh, like I said, I got a, lot, got a bunch of different ideas that I want to do with these. They came out great. They look good. They're lightweight, easy to ship, cheap to ship, and that's that. All right. So yeah, stay tuned for some more reviews from me. Thanks for hanging out. As always, rate, comment, and subscribe. Hit the bell down there. And until next time, peace.